Okay, hey, another three, gentlemen. It's upon us. Platinum Games could really use a dub after Babylon's Fall disaster. A game that nobody played. A game that nobody wanted. But here, we have something that could totally redeem them. Because everyone's been wanting to play the next Bayonetta. It's been, it's been a long time coming. Let's see if, you know, it lives up to the hype. Let's see if it can live up to the expectations. Maybe too soon to tell. Platinum Games. I dig the new look. You mean those weren't your dreamings? Those things ain't for paradiso. No, we get some gameplay. Nice. They're locals. We got Rodin. Hell yeah. For anyone who has never played Bayonetta before, this dude here is responsible for all the crazy weapons. I think maybe most of them? I thought it was all the weapons that Bayonetta, the crazy witch lady, has. Um, this guy is like um, a demon weaponsmith. He's freaking badass. And I'm glad we have him back again. In other words, it's a Luca? Okay, Luca's back. We're seeing lots of familiar faces. Sick. No bed right hell. Oof. This looks rough. And not the gameplay, I mean like... The resolution is dropping rapidly. Damn, that's kind of sick. Straight up kaiju battles. Hell yeah. I don't know who that is. She looks cool. Had to do a quick cut because uh, I was having some audio issues. But anyway, let's continue. This looks like a new character. Uh, not a fan of the hair. I love the sword, but the hair. <laughs> and what do you expect us to do? I want you to find a scientist named Sigurd. Sick. Oh, playable character, huh? Cool. Just analyzing the, the UI real quick. Whoa! She got a grappling hook. New playable character. Man, that's surprising. Wow. Was not expecting that. Luca. I gotta be honest, the hair just looks ridiculous. Looks like uh, when you're making your character, you just kind of randomize, you know? That's what it looks like. It just looks ridiculous to me. Pink on blue on yellow. Pick a color, you know? Goddamn. It just, I feel like it doesn't fit with the Bayonetta aesthetic. I mean, a lot of this stuff looks badass. This is you would expect from a Bayonetta game. And it's coming out. 
It's coming 28th of October. Cool. And that's the funny thing. I always love their designs. They're always so cool and wacky. It's just her hair. I literally don't care about it. The rest of her looks great. Just the fucking ridiculous hair. I'm, I'm probably nitpicking. I don't know, let me know if you feel the same way. And you, you can't change my opinion, I don't really care what you think, I'm just curious to see if anyone feels the same way. Luca's got a new look as well. Like, Bayonetta herself looks amazing. I kinda wanna see her gameplay. I wanna see how this Viola girl plays. I noticed the jump cancel there. Yeah, see? That's cool. I forgot his name, but he's that funny guy who is like carrying Bayonetta's shopping bags and like um, Benetta too. I want to see Viola gameplay. I mean, I'm happy you can play as two characters. I always find that always, like in Devil May Cry, you know, you can play as um, four characters essentially. So if you really dislike V, and if Dante is too hard for you, you have Nero. If Nero is too repetitive for you, you have Dante. You know, so it's really good that you have more options. More options is always good. And her character design is great. Just the fucking stupid hair. Like, <laughs> she looks freaking ridiculous. And I love that. He looks... This guy looks... I love the design. Look at that. Looks like the, um, I forgot the name, but the, the weird cat from Alice in the Wonderland. I'm looking forward to this. Looks really badass. Bayonetta 3. I just really hope. We can have it on other consoles besides just Switch. I really pray for that, matter of fact. Look at this giant dickhead. Hell yeah. Badass. Alright, Platinum Games. For your sake, I hope this is a banger. I mean, it looks like a banger. It really does. <laughs> Look at this crazy train. Look at that. Crazy ass design. Badass. The kind of craziness you can expect from Bayonetta games. It's all here. That's sick. She looks like she plays well too. I can't wait to get my hands on this. Alright, that's enough analyzing. Uh, but please, do let me know your thoughts. I am genuinely curious what others think about this game. Um, so this has been Bayonetta 3, coming October 28th. Yep, October 28th. Be exciting. Um, yeah, can't wait to see more. Uh, that's all I got. See ya.